Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the middleweight bout between Andre Muniz versus Brendan Allen. And how's it going here? I'm going low confidence Andre Muniz. And again, and again, I'm going to say it. I'm not as high on Andre Muniz as a lot of people are is right now. I feel a certain matchup like, oh, good. But this matchup definitely lives a lot of opportunities. Muniz has still shown just to be a one-dimensional grappler. He hasn't shown that over. His striking, I've seen that striking improvement. Like, barely strikes, just grapples. And Brennan Allen overall is the more around the fighter. But we did see him in his last fight get taken down a lot, and he should have probably lost that one. Or was that his last fight? Either way, it was one of the, not his last fight. His last fight, he actually looked pretty good. He submitted a guy who's typically hard to wrestle and grapple in Jocko. He looked good in that one. But the one fight prior to that, I think it was like a split decision that he really probably should have lost, where he got taken down a lot and controlled a lot. But again, that fighter's wrestling probably better than Muniz. BJJ not as good as Muniz at all, but wrestling better than Muniz. So stylists fight, styles make fights. There's definitely opportunities for Brendan Allen to win this one, and he, this should be a much closer odds fight than it is. But I'm going Muniz. I just feel like um, we have seen Dawkins have success taking Brendan Allen down. We have seen this other guy. Have, no, we have seen fighters have success taking um, Allen down. It just that time. I mean, he just has been the better overall fighter and better grappler in those cases. That's just what it is. But going on with Muniz, you never know the same position. You could potentially get tapped out, potentially just get backpacked. But um, yeah, I'm going to go... Um, I'm going to go like a second round submission for uh, Muniz. I just feel like Allen will eventually give those opportunities. Maybe a little bit confident in his jiu-jitsu as well that I can grapple with him, probably. But um, yeah, another bright light to um, Brendan Allen. I think most of his losses have come by getting knocked out. And again, Muniz hasn't shown any striking ability. Maybe he's going to get a ground and pound knock. <laughs> Maybe. But I'm going to say it's like a second round submission. I feel like he's going to take down Allen, be the bigger, more physical man. And I like I said, probably gonna be confident in jiu jitsu, but that confidence is gonna lead to allowing Muniz to get to where he is good at, where he really is a purist at this point. It's just a purist grappler, and he's gonna pose that will, pose that size on Allen, and just be at this, be heavy on top, smother him, take his back, tap him out. I'm gonna say second round for Andre Muniz. So in this one, I have Andre Muniz via second round submission.